without further ado, let us start some comic breaks over here on Nerd Out. These ones are the Haunted Tales edition. So these are pretty cool. Um, just in time for Halloween, since tomorrow is Halloween. Uh, let's see who's in the first break. Actually, let's look and see what some of the um, possible comics that you can get are. Um, while these are just the run hits, there's always some possibilities. Of course, the biggest chase in this entire set is a Nightmare on Elm Street comic signed by many people, including um, Robert Eelson. So yeah, Laura Blake, Kim Myers, Amanda Weiss, and Patrick, or Mark Patton, sorry, and Robert Engel. So that's really cool. Swamp Thing, Werewolf by Night, The Living Mummy, Blade, The Phantom Stranger, Spectre of a, wa of a Stalking Swamp, Weird... Weird War Tales, Spawn, Call of Duty Zombies. Josh is really excited for this one. Ghosts, the boy who cried ghosts. And those are just some of the some of the highlights, but there's a lot of cool other stuff in here. See, like uh, key players, Batman, DC, Ghostbusters, Swamp Things, more players. Like, there's a lot of cool stuff. A lot of potentially cool things to uncover in here. So, without further ado, the first comic, the first break, who's in it? Danny W, Jacob S, Luis V, Nicholas R, and Spencer B. Do some randoms. Six. One, two, three, four, five, and six. Now the names. Seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. All right, so spot one. <clears throat> Sorry. 0, 1 to 20 will go to Luis V. 21 to 40 will go to Jacob S. 41 to 60 will go to Spencer B. 61 to 80 will go to Danny W. 81 to double zero will go to Nicholas R. This is box number 45 out of 50, so near the end of the line. Nine point four. It's like a DC. All right, cool. Neil Gai or uh, Gaiman and David McKean. This is Hellblazer number twenty-seven. 
So this, let's see, DC Comics from 1990. Suggested for mature audiences, so not for the general sales. Tango and Cash on the back. That's fun. So let's see. This is the first appearance of... Ah, so yeah, this is number 27. So this will go to Jacob. Jacob S. Congratulations, Jacob. What's up, The Real Shade? Break two is currently not sold out. However, breaks three and four have. So we're gonna do those. Number three. And let's see who's in for number three. Could be anybody. Number three is William. So it's basically a personal at this point. And number four, is also for William. So we're let's just get right to this. Start with number three. This is number nine out of 50, William. Awesome. Thanks, Davi. That'll save me a little time in a little bit. Let's see. Where are we at? A 9.6. The Walking Dead. Number one. That's cool. I never actually read the comics. I've been meaning to read the comics for The Walking Dead because I hear they're much better. Well, not much better, but like it goes in a different direction. So that's, that's fun. That's really nice. It's got a really nice cover. Can't really fit it all in in the, uh, the overhead camera. Image Comics. Let's see if we can get it. Uh, yeah, that's really nice. So yeah, that's awesome. Perfect for Halloween. Number four is number 16. Break number four is number 16. So mid-teens. Let's see what we get here. I think The Walking Dead's a great start.
I have a love-hate relationship with these boxes. <laughs> Sometimes they're just super easy to open. Other times they fight me to the death. And today it seems to be like they're going to fight me. Nine point oh. The tomb, the Marvel comic group, Tomb of Dracula number forty two. From seventy six. Wow. This is actually pretty cool. Blade and Dracula. To the death against Doctor Sun. What? That's cool. The Tomb of Dracula, Lord of Vampires. Why is Blade working with... Oh, looks like Blade and um, Dracula are both being attacked by uh, some military personnel, and now he's falling into the pit. I wonder what's in here. Is that a brain? I wish comics still cost 25 cents. This is a pretty cool cover. Like, this is, I want to read this. Because <laughs> I'm so curious. I've never heard of this one. This is cool. Comic Don's number one fear magazine. This is cool. This blade appearance. Yep. This is cool. This is fun. So that's cool, William. Both are definitely very Halloween-y. Well, I know they're all, they all are, actually. But, like, yeah, Dracula and vampires. Va yeah, vampires and zombies. Thank you very much for everyone to buying those out. Thanks, William, for buying those other two comics out. And everybody else that got into the first break, that was a lot of fun. I appreciate all of it. Every single order you guys ever put through lets me open up a lot of really, really cool stuff. And I always enjoy it. And happy Halloween tomorrow to everybody. And enjoy. <laughs>